Now over there in India, when they get up in the golden years like old world is, they get a great retirement because it's a mortal sin for any harm to come to those cattle. So they just cut them loose, set them free. Those guys can go to town, they go to their neighbors, they can really do anything they want to do. Folks over there will take care of them the rest of their days. And I call that a pretty good cattle retirement. Now right in this area of the trail is where Hurricane Francis comes ripping through Silver Spring Nature Park in 2004. Now that took out over 150 shrubs and trees in this area and flooded everything. Everything was underwater for over six months. Yeah, you know, a lot of damage. You know, before the hurricane, when you come through here with a jeep, this one comes right in right in this area so bad you'd have to put the headlights on the jeep to find these cattle bars down here. Luckily for you guys, it's gonna grow back just like it was in about 150 years. And I'm gonna invite every one of you back here to check it out. separates and divides. The old Cala National Forest from our park. Our park's a little over 350 acres. And that forest right there is a little over 380,000 acres. Very huge forest with a lot of very, very dangerous animals. I ain't just talking about the wild hogs and alligators and all this stuff. Just made up to Florida. People move into this state every day from all over the world. A lot of them bring critters with them. They can survive in the forest here, something happens, they let them loose. All right, right here on the right, some more damage we got from last weekend's storm. We lost another beautiful live oak tree right there. If you look, if you look at the stump on that, 
you can't tell, you can see that that's just a beautiful tree. It just lost its, uh, just lost its foot in there. All there is to it. Okay, this area of the wilderness trail right here is what we call the movie area because this is where all the filming's been done over the last 80 or 90 years. Now, I want you to look right back up on the left, back in that opening there, and I want to show you another set of twin cypress trees. They're not as big as the other one, but I'm pointing them out because that's where the original Tarzan and Jane treehouse was back in the late 30s and 40s when Johnny Whitehill came in here and they created the Tarzan film. There have been over 90 films created in this, or finished in this area of the park right here. Up until about the mid 80s, this place is always full of camera crews and a movie guy who's out here getting wood and waters for their films. But about the mid 80s is where the computer and digital and everything come in pretty good, so they don't have to be out here anymore. Ain't been out here in 15, 18, 20 years. You look around the forest, you can't tell they ever was here because you give Mother Nature enough time. She'll put her force right back to the way she thinks it ought to be. You can just count on that. But Mother Nature is always, always going to be here for us. Now up here on the right, we got this old jeep sitting up here. I'm going to show you what's up on the bridge here. We really think the Tarzan folks left it there because by looking at that old jeep, it looked like a little cheetah with the main driver on it. There it is, right there on the right. Thank you. 